Hello everybody, this is Mike from the Piss and Vinegar page. And I want to talk to you guys about something that I saw last night on the food vendors across the USA forum or page on Facebook. A young lady talked about how she had to give up a higher percentage and negotiated this to get a job that she wanted. I couldn't believe some of the comments on there on um, people that just didn't agree with the way she went about it having to give up a bigger percentage to get this particular job me however I'm all for giving up big percentages and let me tell you why and the way I do it so maybe in your business you can do this too tonight we're gonna relax a little bit I got me a wonderful cigar cold adult beverage no fancy intros none of that just me and you sitting on the deck talking about percentages are you ready okay here we go using big percentages is a fantastic way to get really big jobs and I don't just mean little fairs, I mean like high school football games, minor league, sports stadiums, whatever. This is a fantastic way to get in there because other people just won't do it. Why won't people give up a big percentage? Number one, I think they're scared. They're afraid that they're going to make the money that they should make. Number two, children put on your earmuffs. Ladies, I apologize in advance. They just don't have the balls. They, they just won't do it. And number three is ego. No way I'm giving up 30% to get into an event. That's ridiculous. I, I don't give up 15 or 20% maximum. That's what I'm hearing from people. And to me, it's kind of ludicrous to be honest with you. Volume equals dollars. Period. Okay? If you're moving massive volume, you're going to make a lot of money. Pretty simple, right? Sometimes to get into these events, you've got to pay a little more. You've got to give a higher percentage. you got to give a higher spot up to, to get this job. And I would rather make five, six thousand dollars net off uh, eleven, twelve thousand dollar job than make a thousand dollars net off of a two thousand dollar job. It's pretty simple, but that thing is hard for people to grasp, and and I don't get it. Number four. Organizations cannot say no to big percentages. For instance, for me, I gave up 35% of gross revenue to do full concessions for a high school. It just makes too much sense for them. They're collecting 35% for doing nothing. And I get the high school, all the football games, all the basketball games, and all the other little things that come with it. This catapulted me to get two high schools, to get three and then four high schools because these area districts were finding out how much I was giving off a of percentage and they couldn't say no. They were calling me. I had to turn down a district with four high schools Three, three middle schools and quite a bit of few elementaries to do everything. I just didn't have the manpower to do it. But they heard what I was giving up and they wanted it. I don't know. Something to consider for you guys. Number six. Well, to me, I have them listed here, but you can't see that. Number six. Giving up a little more more, more than a little more percentage equals huge 
returned. Not only do I have the high schools, but actual cities were calling me to take over their whole sports parks and all of them because of the percentage I was giving up. No other vendor would do it. Vendors were, I, I put them all out. No one could even bid on a job. I blew them all out the water because I'm willing to give up 25, 30, and 35% to get these jobs. That is how I got to 20 locations. That's how I got the 50 people working with us. And I'm not even gonna talk about the gross or the net revenue that I get. But don't be afraid, guys, to give up big percentages to get in, to get a job you know will pay off, and maybe we'll land to future other jobs besides that. This is Mike, and the Piss of Vinegar page, and that's been my time.